American Pie 1999. In this film, we see a group of friends who are trying to lose their virginity. Let's see if they succeed or not. In the opening scene of the movie, we witness Jim, a young man, preparing to watch an explicit movie in bed with the aid of a sock. As he becomes engrossed in the video, his mother unexpectedly walks in on him, causing him to hide his excitement under a pillow. Though she initially doesn't notice the video, his mother eventually discovers it and expresses her disappointment. Soon after Jim's father arrives and they both reprimand him, Jim's father confiscates the remote to turn off the video, but in doing so, also unknowingly grabs the pillow hiding Jim's sock. The embarrassing incident leaves Jim mortified. When the scene shifts, Jim is pictured in high school with his four friends, Stifler, Oz, Kevin, and Finch. One of the buddies, Stifler, is seen inviting the other friends to a party at his residence. The four pals can be seen talking about this party later. As they converse, we find that the four buddies are still virgins and are eager to leave this status. Only the part host Stifler is not a virgin. They are aware that many stunning girls attend these events. At this party, they agree to strike a deal to meet women and finally give up their virginity. The companions depart to prepare for the celebration. The friends at the party appear uneasy but happy in the following scenario. Jim and his friends attend a party hosted by Stifler with the goal of losing their virginity. Jim's crush, Nadia, is also at the party, and he wants to impress her. However, when he talks to her, he becomes too excited and makes a bad impression, causing him to feel embarrassed and defeated. Kevin and Vicky make out, but Vicky is not ready to lose her virginity yet. Stifler walks in with a girl, and Kevin tells Jim that he and Vicky didn't have sex yet. Vicky overhears and leaves the party, feeling betrayed by Kevin. The following day, the four friends gather at Stifler's house and witness a guy named Sherman coming downstairs with a girl who he slept with. This incident motivates the friends to make a resolution to lose their virginity before graduation. Later, Oz joins a music class to get closer to his crush Heather, and the plan works as he gains her attention. The other friends Jim, Stifler, and Kevin feel proud of Oz's achievement. Jim is seen in his room in the next scene. His father enters to talk about his actions. To prevent him from using porn again, his father offers him several Playboy magazines. Jim nods along with his father's words despite his uncomfortable feeling. The magazines are left in the drawer by his father. Kevin is seeking assistance from a pal after disappointing his girlfriend Vicky. His pals advise him to take out a book from the library to read. Kevin accepts this arrangement and heads out to the library. On the other hand, Oz is improving in the music lesson and eventually makes a connection with Heather. Jim discovers something on his kitchen table when he gets home from school. His mother has made him a pie. Jim quickly uses the pie as a masturbator after sticking two fingers inside of it. Sadly, Jim is caught in the act as his father enters the house. Jim is once again forced to watch in shame as his father berates him. Kevin gets a book from the library with information about pleasing girls while Oz impresses his crush Heather during a sports game. Heather asks Oz to be her prom date and he accepts but his friends act immaturely, which disappoints Heather. Kevin apologizes to Vicky and tries to please her using instructions from a book he got from the library. Jim's crush, Nadia, asks him for help with history and agrees to study at his house, which excites his friends. They convince him to place a hidden camera to spy on Nadia while she changes. In this scene, Oz tries to talk to Heather, but she cancels their plans for prom night, and expresses her frustration. Meanwhile, Jim sets up a camera in his room and shares the live feed with his friends. While Nadia changes her clothes, she finds a Playboy magazine in Jim's room and starts to masturbate, which the friends watching can't believe. The friends who are viewing this are in disbelief. Jim is told by Kevin that today is the ideal time for him to become a virgin. In order to be with Nadia, Jim dashes over to his residence. Sherman phones Kevin in the meantime, and it is discovered that Jim shared the link with the entire school, rather than just his pals. Jim struggles to deal with Nadia's sexual advances toward him. Premature ejaculation causes him to shame himself in front of everyone at school, not just Nadia. He knows he can't perform anymore, according to Nadia. The whole school is mocking Jim for his premature ejaculation, and Nadia is forced to move back to her hometown due to the bullying. Heather sees a different side of Oz as he practices for his music class. Jim meets a new girl named Mitchell in class, 
Anne asks her to prom. Relieved that she doesn't know about the embarrassing incident, Oz and Heather reconcile at the restaurant, while Stifler tries to secure a prom date but fails when the girl chooses Finch instead. Oz informs Heather that he can't attend their musical performance due to a scheduling conflict, upsetting her. Stifler adds a drug to Finch's drink, causing him to have a bowel movement in the ladies' room and leading to humiliation and mockery from Stifler and others. Heather gets bullied for not having a prom date and misses Oz, who is distracted during his game due to his concern for Heather. At halftime, Oz leaves the game and meets Heather, and they kiss and perform a perfect musical. Meanwhile, everyone is getting ready for prom night, and Jim's dad lectures him, but Jim remains confident. At the prom, Jim and Oz decide not to force themselves on their love interests, Nadia and Heather respectively, and leave. Vicky's friend Jessica asks Finch to be her partner, while Kevin feels alone and goes outside to sit. During the party, a girl announces that Sherman paid her to lie about sleeping with him, embarrassing him in front of everyone. The four friends meet up outside and are happy that Sherman was exposed. The prom ends and everyone leaves with their dates. Kevin takes Vicky to a room in Stifler's house. Oz and Heather are seen walking outside, where Oz admits that he initially joined the musical class just to impress and sleep with her. However, he now truly loves and respects her. Heather is pleased and confesses her love for him as well, and they kiss. Later, Finch visits Stifler's house and meets Stifler's mom. Finch attempts to flirt with her, and it appears to be working as she seems interested in him. The scene changes as they become more flirtatious. We can now see Mitchell and Jim. She admits that she was aware that Jim had shared his footage. In the room, Kevin and Vicky are having sex. Outside, Oz and Heather are having a lovely moment. In the home, Finch and Stifler's mother is becoming closer as well. They head to a pool table together. Jim is let inside a room by Mitchell. Mitchell screams that he lied and engages in abusive sexual behavior with him. All four of the companions lose their virginity by dawn. Vicky decides she can't handle a relationship in college, so she breaks up with Kevin. Jim was still lying in bed when Mitchell left. When Stifler sees Finch with his mother, he pukes from revulsion. Later we see all four friends eating together. They are all happy to finally complete the solution. They try to ask Oz about his night out. But Oz refuses to say anything because it's a personal matter. The friends respect his decision and look forward to going to college, too. At the end of the movie, we see Jim having a video call with Nadia. They both seem happy to see each other. Funny enough, he strips down and starts dancing for Nadia. His father appears from behind, but Jim does not notice him. His father also leaves the room and starts dancing. If you liked the video hit the like button and subscribe to our channel and leave a comment for the next glimpse it.